What's up everybody, it is Pete Wagner from another fishing show. Greg is behind the camera there. I've got Pete Mana sitting in this crowded house next to me. Blake Bedmar, Blake Bednar, <laughs> Northwoods <laughs> Angling, there's too many names here. Sam is working hard, Alex Perrick, we got Rebecca right here, and we are chasing sturgeon on the St. Croix River. They've got a house next to us, we're not all fishing in this house, that would be complete chaos. We have pizza, and we have nothing but time. Got one. What? Oh, yeah. You're nice. first. Everybody in our tent is so giddy. It's like these guys have never seen a blonde or heard of a blonde catching a sturgeon before. Congratulations. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> nice work. Alex Perrick and his group are in a tent next to us. And there's kind of a friendly competition going on. Who can catch the most sturgeon? You guys got any bites yet? No, no. Just a lot of personality. How we're fishing for these sturgeon is with an eighth ounce spoon, you tip a bunch of night crawlers and fathead minnows onto the treble hook. I can't believe my spoon passed the Bednar test. <laughs> <laughs> you drop that spoon down the hole, right to the bottom of the river. It sits right down there. All that spoon is basically doing, it's a weight to hold those night crawlers and those fathead minnows on the bottom. Now everybody look at these strike indicators. You'll notice this one, they all have a little different lean here. You see how that one is kind of tilted up, and then this one's kind of part way. Now you'll notice mine over here is actually leaning down a little bit, and I think that's really going to be the key. I have set it up. <laughs> actually, I know nothing about sturgeon fishing. But <laughs> now watch, this one is going to be the light bite, but you're going to be able to see that, and I predict the first bite is going to be right there. So how you detect a sturgeon bite is you clip on a foam float just like you use for ice fishing. When that sturgeon picks up that spoon, it'll start moving that line. You'll see that float move and that's how you know you're getting a bite. Anybody want this Wagner? I think. Let me get this out of your way. Oh, geez. Now I just wail. <laughs> A lot of times what's happening is your line is tight going from the top of the hole to the bottom and fish are hitting just running into the line. It's not even a bite. I often employ frustration and anger to encourage fish to bite. What if we don't look at the count of 10 if we all look to the back of the tent? <laughs> I'm a freelance videographer and I've worked with Pete Mana a ton. We've done a ton of shows together and he's a big believer in sound and how sound can be used to attract fish. Livingston Lures, who I work with, developing a predator line of baits. Their lures have a sound maker in every single one and a battery system. They got this new thing they're testing called a chummer, which basically is different bait fish sounds, but it's ten times louder than the ones they put in the lures. I like where and you're going with this. I have some along. Ooh. And I Why thought, aren't they in the water? Well, I, you guys, we got here talking, they were throwing pizza around, and you know. No, it's time. Blake hooks the sound attractor up to a rod and drops it down the hole. <laughs> here we go, here we go. Oh, there we go. The sound attractor actually worked. That did it. I'm telling you. Now, yeah. do we need that? Do we need that other rod or line up? How's he feeling, Pete? I saw him. He's not a monster. We got one. We don't know what we got. Yeah, loosen up the drag a little bit. We're gonna have some fun. He heard that squealing. <laughs> what are you thinking, Pete? I like it. I like it. It's a big fish. Get that bobber out of the pool. There he is. Yep. It's the right species. It, it's not a 90 pounder. It's not. Hey. But it ate it. But my first sturgeon through the ice. There we go. Huh? There we go. <laughs> we did her. said for that. Yeah. <laughs> Here you go, buddy. Very cool. Oh, you're such a cutie. Oh, he's it's got something to say to you. Talking to me, too. Well, he heard the bait talking to him down there, and now he's Look talking at back. That. Yeah, yeah. Oh, smile. Mana's first targeted ice lake sturgeon, St. Croix River. You know what? He might be a little big for a quick strike rig, but. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> that is a cool fish. Wow. I could put my finger right in its mouth. You see that? <laughs> was he hooked in the mouth? Yep. Yeah, he oh, was. Yeah. Got him yeah. where he was supposed yeah, to. Yeah, he had it in. Well, very cool, guys. All right, that's With. one. That's one. Yeah, sure that I'll bay get had that. Been contributed. That fish, its bait was in the center hole. Two feet away was this attractant machine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it came right in. It did. It came right in. Pete seen it, triggered the bobber, popped the bobber off, he set the hook. <laughs> and we yielded results, Pete. All right, well, go down there and tell your friends. Grandpa. Tell Grandpa to come yeah. over and pass a visit. Oh, oh no, no, no. He wants to stay. Away. Now, come on. There we go. Head and first. <laughs> Nicely done. <laughs> Excellent work. Oh, all right. Down to the bottom. All We're right. ahead of that shack now. Uh, one we to are. one, but theirs was that big and ours was that big. So much of fishing isn't just about the catching. Yeah, that's beautiful. Heart of Wisconsin. Yeah. It's the experience of fishing with friends and storytelling. So My first yeah. mu musky pictures were yeah. on uh, Polaroid. You know what I mean? <laughs> you probably don't know. No, I don't even know what that is. Yeah, they're coming back. You'd hit the button and the picture would pop out and you'd have to wave it around a little bit. The fishing is slow, but this is a perfect example that you can still have have a great fishing day with friends, have great stories to tell. Yeah, the thing about surgery fishing is you just kind of sit and wait and tell some good old stories and hopefully something comes in. If not, you still share a good time in the ice hut. Well said. As soon as this production began, Pete Wagner started drinking. And now he's hitting the hard stuff. Whoa! Golden rule in fishing. If the fish aren't biting, start with your friends. Oh, that's great. And it's a slow rise, like over your head. And they're both filming because I'm holding this thing in the air. Uh, yeah, I you know. I'm going to pay for it. You're going to me up one of these days, are you? All right, well, we need to get out of here before uh, Pete burns his pants off. We're sitting yeah. a little too close to the heater. Big thanks to Northwood Angling, thanks to Jacob. Northwood. All right. Yeah, we're Take two. We need to get out of here before Mr. Pete Mina burns his pants off. A big thank you to Northwood's Angling for hosting us this evening in this freezing, cold ice house with warm company. Yeah. So thank you, Jacob. Thank you, Blake. You're doing a great job on the camera. Thanks to Pete Mayna and an awesome hat and the whole thing and my buddy yes. Greg. We will see you guys. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel. You got to do it again. Ah, son you of a it. From the top. Please subscribe. Take three. Well, guys, the fishing was a little slow tonight, but Pete got his first, uh, sorry. I almost said musky. All right, guys, well, the fishing was a little slow tonight. <laughs> All right, guys, well, God, you're stepping on my lines. All right, guys, well, the fishing was a little slow tonight, but Pete got his first sturgeon through the ice. I did. I we did. accomplished that. We got to hang out with our friends from Northwood Angling. And what? 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 You want a mic, Greg? This is painful. All I wanted was a sturgeon. Let's let the pro handle this. Oh my goodness, what a fun night, but not exactly the greatest fishing. Pete, you caught your first sturgeon though. I'm super excited about that. I want to thank Northwoods Angling. Subscribe to Northwoods Angling if you haven't already. Pete Main, a professional musky angler, subscribe to his channel. Thank you for joining us. We'll Later, see you everybody. Next time. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. Want to let you know we have started a Patreon page. Yes, we we are in the 21st century now. We have a Patreon page. It is the very best way to support Angling Uploaded. Become a patron and you will receive content before anybody else, exclusive live streams, and greater interaction with Pete and I, and so much more. Really appreciate your support, guys.